it's that time again. Let's go back to Operation Gold, and this time our GIS analyst and also a former Marine, Brett Rose. Simplify, John. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, I've been monitoring the situation so far, but I'm using a different configuration of the dashboard that's providing me with the information I need to perform my real-time analysis. My map on the left is showing the current position of our, team, uh, of our team in the field there. The center map is showing all the gold we've collected so far. Then on the right, I have a, a metro routing map. But we want to really understand the distributions of our teams as they progress. So I'm going to switch to desktop to, do, to show some analysis I've been performing as the teams have been moving. So moments ago, I ran our, my team distribution analysis. I'm going to go ahead and add that back to my display. Now, these are ellipses that show the positions of our teams, um, a, a statistical distribution and orientation of our teams as they moved through the, the geography. So we can really see some interesting things going on as far as how the teams are behaving and moving. So the blue team, which is shown uh, in blue, the blue uh, ellipsoid, shows that they really casted a very wide net. It's pretty obvious. But if we look, the, the, the purple and orange team have stayed really focused, mainly just sort of as tight formations walking around Chinatown and just south of the, of the convention center. So that's really interesting, the different patterns that we see. But we also want to understand how these different patterns impact or re are reflected in the gold we've collected. So I've also done a coverage analysis earlier. But the thing about these analyses is we can share them across the entire platform. So let's go back to our dashboard and bring those in. So first, I'll add back our uh, team distributions so we can see that directional distribution right inside of our, our team map there. And then in our gold map, I'll switch out our current collection gold for my coverage analysis. Oop. I don't need a new base map. So this map highlights a few things. Uh, one is that, that, that blue team, they've gone really well up north, haven't they? But you may notice here that we're, there's probably some areas that we're kind of missing out on where there's probably a lot of gold. For example, in between Farragut North and, and DuPont Circle. So we, maybe we, we want to send some of our team members who are in that concentrated area south of the convention center up there. So I'll use my routing map because it's a great way to get across the city in a short amount of time. And we'll look right here at the metro station at Judiciary Square. And the polygons you see right now are the, the uh, walk distance that are greater than three minutes so there's a three minute and a six minute. So the Shady Grove train is in three minutes. And it looks like Darren here, who's that black X, he can probably make it up there. So we can go ahead and deploy him and he have him head towards Farragut North and, and collect around there. So by bringing analysis right into our real-time operation, we'll be, we're, as a GIS analyst, I can contribute and improve the mission and help for its success. <laughs> 